All right, so the refraction is plus a quarter plus a quarter at 105. But in order to get some extended depth of focus and keep a plano refraction, instead of targeting plano, I'm gonna target minus 0.5, but I'm gonna say the refraction was 0.5 less. So here it's minus a quarter, here it's plus a quarter, right? But the cylinder and the axis are the same. Targeting between negative 0.5 and negative 2.5 with the first LDD treatment adds a boost of negative spherical aberration, broadening the defocus curve on the hyperopic side. This will allow us to later target more myopia without causing a significant adverse effect on the distance vision. So I hope that made sense. So his actual refraction is plus a quarter plus a quarter 105. We're going to say it's minus a quarter plus a quarter 105. So we're half diopter different because our target is actually Plano. But to get the extended depth of focus, we're going to tell the machine that the target is minus 0.5. So hopefully his reading vision gets better from J16. Even though he's plus a quarter plus a quarter, I put minus a quarter plus a quarter. And then we're going to say we're targeting minus a half. All right. In his second eye, he's a plus a half plus a quarter, but we're going to tell the machine he's plano plus a quarter. Okay. All right. So we shifted him half, said plano plus a quarter, and we're targeting minus a half. I'm trying to just make. That's it. All right. So here we are after the first adjustment. In this adjustment, we targeted the spherical equivalent of Plano, but we did um, tell the machine we wanted to aim for minus a half, but added a minus a half to his refraction last time, just to kind of trick the machine in a way. But his distance is still excellent. It's 2020. Um, his refractive error is here. He was J, I think it was around 16 last time. We're going to see if he's any different today. Now, here, you can see, read this one. 2843. How about here? 68. Any of these or no? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, but it's, at first, I think, I don't know. So this is where you end up with this yeah, side? Yeah, and, and down I think uh, 745, right? For okay. 3, 8, or 6, 8. Okay, got it. So, 7, 4, 5. so the first one you have trouble with, but the last three you can get. So you're between J7 and J10. Okay. How about your other eye? Cover, switch eyes. Okay. Now, we're going to try this left eye. Try this one. Two, two, eight, four, three. Okay, try this one. Six, three, eight. Okay, how about here? Eight, seven, four, five. Okay. And I want you to try here. Uh, Six, three, nine, two, five, maybe. Okay, so you're about J5 right now with the uh, left eye. And here we are on treatment two. His refraction was plus a quarter. And I have the option of targeting either Plano or maybe minus a quarter. Since this is his dominant eye, I do not want his distance vision to suffer. But it looked like when I put in a plus half diopter trial lens in front of his right eye, he really appreciated the near vision improvement and he didn't seem to mind the change in distance vision. He seemed like it was pretty good. So I'm okay with shifting a half a point uh, on this right eye. And the left eye, his non-dominant eye, I am gonna uh, target a minus 0.75. So I'm gonna go a little bit stronger on the reading on this eye so that together, hopefully, he can see far and up close very well. So here we are, the manifest refraction of plus a quarter, and our target is minus a quarter. This is the dominant eye. You're doing great. Perfect. On the second eye, 
the there's the refraction, and this is our target. And this is the way we set it up. So we just have uh, one eye covered like that, and then the second eye exposed, and then we're gonna do the light treatment. First, uh, cover your left eye, and then we're gonna have you read some letters here. Okay, can you uh, read these letters for me? Okay, can you read these? All right, how about this? All right, how about, can you read that? Good, how about this very small one here? Try. I see it before last is L. Good. Uh huh. O O D. Okay. M E S. Okay. Last last is O O C. Okay. So just to give you an idea how small this is, <laughs> that's very good. All right. All right. There we go. Okay, so now uh, cover the other side. All right, cover the right eye. This is the one we made for near, okay? So I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. All right, so uh, try to read that for me. Okay, how about this one? And this one? Good. How about this? Okay, so, so these are three out of the five, and this one, this is the near eye, okay? So now we're going to have a reading card. Now cover your left eye, all right? Cover your left eye, and hold this. I'll take the glasses, or you can put the glasses on the side. Take uh, this here, and this is your distance eye, and let's hold it, yeah, right around there. And I want you to read first, uh, let's say, let's see which line. Read this line here. Eight, seven, four, five. Good. How about here? Can you try to read this one right uh, here? Under. First, six or eight, I don't know. Okay. Six, three, five, uh, nine, nine to five. Okay. Uh, Any of these? Four, two, Six, no. Okay, so three, that's three, six, five. Good. So that's pretty good. Mm. Any of these or no? I see. I think first is three. Yeah. Seven, four, two, five, six or eight. Right? Wow. Okay. All right. Now um, the right eye uh, is your dominant eye without the epiretinal membrane. Now cover your right eye. All right. Yeah. Cover the right eye. Okay, and now I'm going to have you do the same thing. Four, two, eight, three, uh, six, five. Okay, so that's the last yeah, one you uh, see right here. And, and, and after them, see three, seven, four, two, seven, four, two, five, eight, or six. Okay, and any of the other ones? And that one's the two. Second is two? No. No? Uh, 37? Yeah. So. Seven, Seven after seven, no, no, uh, before last is two. Yeah, that's and, true. Overall, his vision is pretty good. Far vision in the right eye, of course, is stronger than the left. Left has slightly better reading vision, not too much degradation of the uh, uh, distance. Together, both eyes work pretty well. All right. Okay. I see the one. Uh, Four, two, eight, three, six, five. Okay. Three, seven, four, two, five, eight, six, yeah. seven. Okay. Uh, again, in the middle, seven. Okay. Nine, three, seven, okay. eight, two, six. Okay. That's pretty good. All right. The purpose of this video is to show you my current approach to LDD treatments. I personally use the LAL in patients who want the highest quality far vision day and night. My patients are told they will likely need reading glasses for fine print reading. Therefore, in my experience, adding less myopia than you think seems to provide the best result. 
However, if you are using the LAL to eliminate reading glasses altogether, you may want to target more myopia in the non-dominant eye. I hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.